It's Tuesday, August 9th, 2011, and this is the Nittany Minute. On Monday afternoon, Nate Bauer from Blue White Illustrated reported that Penn State football coach Joe Paterno was taken to a hospital after being run into by a player during a practice on Sunday. Now here we are on Tuesday, and it's expected that Paterno will be released as early as today from Mount Nittany Medical Center. What we know at this point is that he has suffered hairline fractures on his pelvis and his right arm. And by all accounts, he's intending to be back at practice as quickly as possible. And I think nobody would expect anything less from Joe. Now the question is whether or not it's safe for him to be on those sidelines. And that's something that a few people have thrown out there already in the last 24 hours. People are wondering, is it safe for an 84-year-old man who can't hear as well as he used to and he can't move around quite as well as he used to as well? Uh, is it safe for him to be out there with players going full speed in practices and during a game? You know, that's a question that's going to be looked into, I'm sure, by the coaching staff and as well as Paterno. It would be serving him well to be thinking about himself sometimes. I know he doesn't like to do that a lot, but it would be nice if he thought about himself and just thought about his own safety a little bit. So we'll see what happens going forward. Uh, like I said, he'll be back as soon as he can. I have no doubt about that. But let me know what you guys think. Just leave your comments down below about this topic, and we'll continue that conversation throughout the week. This is Kevin McGuire, and this has been the Nittany Minute. S -T -A -T.